So this is my pump. It's a 20 to 60 gal per hour, I'm guessing. Uh, pump. It's got two things. They come down to these things. They're supposed to be like one-way check valves so in case the pump shuts off you're always supposed to have your pump above your T bucket in case the pump shuts off it won't flow back all the sediment and shit in the bucket won't go into the pump and burn it up that's what these little check valves are for in case it's like an emergency backup system but I got my pump up way high compared to my buckets so I really don't need them but they came with it so I put them on um I just drilled a hole in the center of my bucket here so I can still latch it up I'm gonna hook up some kind of vent here I don't know but uh here's what I got going on Got two stones down here above one, real good. I stole a pair of my wife's pantyhose. <laughs> hey, there's my stones. This is what I got down at the bottom. They seem to work pretty good. Bubbling that shit up. What do I got here? Poop! Not my poop, ladies and gentlemen. It's a wonder worm. Worm casting. Nature's best fertilizer. Hands down. I like to spray my plants with it. It really helps. Helps them build up a resistance to uh, mold and other bullshit like bugs and what have you. It's pretty good shit. Well, it's the best shit, ladies and gentlemen. That's how I get those 11 foot trees. It's my secret. There you have it. My very first compost tea bucket and pump. Then we went all out, bought the little doodads. You got your pH tester. Pretty simple. You hit the switch. Tells you what's going on. And then over here we got the part per million tester. You just hit the button. Pretty simple.